Cleaning Senior High School is a government high school catering for a proud 1,200 students in years 8 to 12. We endeavour to keep our information technology equipment as up to date as we possibly can and we also make an earnest endeavour to ensure that it is used right across the curriculum rather than it becoming identified as just a computing type subject. Most of the information that students consume these days is of an audio-visual nature rather than a simple text nature and for too long um, the expressive opportunities that kids have had at school has basically been restricted to, to writing stories in a textual sense. The technology program that we have here is of particular benefit to students, for example, in our visual and performing arts area. They've been making great use of the, the Macintosh technology in the music area. Macintoshes are used throughout the performing arts um, at, the, at Leeming Senior High School, predominantly in the music area where we've gone completely to um, teaching the music and society course. The rationale for using technology in the arts is that rapidly things are changing within the industry. We're dealing with uh, basic programs that create a backing for you, like band in the box to sequencing programs and that sort of thing. It's a fantastic composition tool for a start. It makes it very easy for the kids okay. when they're composing something, trying to put a piece of music together, to get instant feedback on what they're doing. It helps me to train my ear for things like different chords. So when, when they play it to me in the exam, I'll be able to think, yeah, I know that chord, I can write it down. Macintosh allows me to listen to my compositions without actually needing a band or an orchestra. Another project in a similar vein is the uh, Star Wars project where we're uh, remaking The Return of the Jedi movie. It's a film which requires a good deal of technical special effects and yeah. digital post-production techniques. It really addresses what's at the core of, of many high school students' lives these days and that's an intense media-rich experience. We can't afford big sets so most of the uh, action will actually take in front of a blue screen and then we can digitally composite that uh, live action uh, with uh, digitally painted sets so that we can actually have students uh, create um, the backgrounds in the visual arts area. I then went into strata media paint and began by laying down a white background for the blade. This technique's called rotoscoping, something that uh, major studios have um, done for years. One of the challenges we, we had was to uh, build a computer controlled camera. So we've got a small one chip camera mounted at the front here and uh, we've actually used uh, another technology which the students have, uh, have become familiar with which is the Lego Dacta technology. We can actually view uh, what we're seeing on camera in real time on the Macintosh. We can uh, pitch it forward. We can also um, rotate in either direction. We can raise it and lower it so is that under the um, program control uh, on the Macintosh, we can actually fly the camera over a terrain on a predetermined path. One of the things we like about the Mac is the fact that um, we can pretty much point it at any job that we have, and it simply works. <laughs>